Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm Raghavin Mishra and in this video we will be installing OpenJDK 11 on Ubuntu 22.04.3 install on Windows 11 using VirtualBox. So far in this series we have covered how to install VirtualBox 7 on Windows 11 and how to install Ubuntu 22 LTS on VirtualBox in Windows 11 and we have covered these steps. Okay, So you can uh, watch my previous video in this playlist and as part of this uh, video we are going to install uh, openjdk 11 okay so i'll be installing openjdk 11 so uh, let us go to the virtual box and uh, uh, yeah and go to the vm we have okay so i'll click on show and uh, just in case if you have closed this by any chance uh, you have to start it okay i'll be cancelling it for now and uh, then i will go to the i'll go to the open in terminal i will just do right click and open in terminal just right click and open in terminal so i'm gonna give uh, some command to install so what is that command sudo apt hyphen get install open jdk 11 jdk okay so this is the command i'm just going to you know copy it okay so as part of this video, we'll also uh, see how to enable copy paste from the host to VM in VirtualBox and also we'll see a username is not in the sudo or file. Just in case if we come across these issues, uh, we will see how to resolve and how to fix those errors as well. Right. So I have copied this command uh, to the clipboard and I'm trying to you know paste it over here. Okay. See the old uh, one which i have copied earlier is getting copied right which i have i would have you know copied from this so i'm just trying to you know copy this command open jdk 11 there is no one or something right if i cancel and uh, try to paste it over here same thing jdk 11 is getting copied okay say suppose if i copy it over here then copy paste will of course work okay and i can I can simply cancel and uh, if I paste it over here, see if I copy this uh, command, let us copy this sudo. Okay, so I'm just copy, I'm just copying it and I will be pasting over here. See, copy paste is working uh, fine uh, in the scope of this terminal, but if I'm trying to you know, copy something from the, my host. Uh, to this vm it is not working it is still copying or uh, pasting sudo sudo right so how to enable this how to enable I'll, I'll cancel it and how to enable this copy paste from host to vm in virtualbox this is very important and because uh, you may come across you know certain you know instruction uh, to follow right so you have a list of uh, commands to execute on the vm so you'll be copying from your host and directly trying to you know execute on the vm but if this uh, particular you know, option is not enabled, then you will find it difficult, right? So how to enable it? So you have to go to the uh, your machine and the virtual box, basically, of course. And here in the file menu, right? There is a file menu and there is a machine. A couple of menus are there, right? Items. So you have to go to the machine and go to the setting. Inside setting, you have to be in general and then click on advanced tab. And here you can see the option share clipboard, right? Which is by default set to disabled. So you have to enable it to the bi-directional. Okay. And then click on OK. So right after this, what you can do, you can again go here to your host and copy the command and try to paste it over here. See, this time it is getting uh, copy pasted. Okay. I'm able to you know, paste on that command. So this particular you know, option copy paste is enabled from host to virtual box from host to VM in virtual box basically. So yeah, now I'll press enter and give the password. Okay. So I'm going to give the password and at times when you see this username is not in the sudo or files, what you have to do either you can add this username into the sudo file or for as a quick workaround, you, what you can do, like you can switch to the uh, root user by executing su command, okay, and give the password, same password. You can see now sdata has been switched to a root, okay. So I'm gonna uh, 
uh, run this command let me copy it again from here same thing it is all already copied in the click uh, clipboard so we can paste it over there in the vm if not we can again you know copy paste so i have to enter i have to type y and press enter so this uh, java open jdk 11 is going to install open jdk 11 jdk is going to install okay so it is unpacking and it may take its own time to install so just have patience yeah and then it is done okay so let us see the uh, java version basically what it has installed so you can see java open jdk 11.0.21 has been installed okay so now uh, again if i may have to you know press i may see this and also if i have to validate if java c and other things are working those commands are working or not java it is all working fine okay now for quick verification i can create one file and uh, see if it is you know uh, we are we have installed the stable uh, you know jdk and uh, basically which is uh, working or functional as expected so at what i'll do i will simply uh, copy paste the hello world program over here in the vm and since we have enabled see we have enabled that uh, copy paste option right we have enabled copy paste from host to vm so it is easy for us to you know copy anything now so now i can do vi test.java and i will simply paste the content which i have copied okay so this is going to be my java file test.java so i'm going to compile this test.java directly yeah so i can you know simply uh, compile i can run it okay i can run, run it like this so hello world you can see right it got compiled and it got executed also yeah so this java 11.0.21 whatever we have installed right is working fine on the ubuntu 22.04.3 lts installed on windows 11 using virtual box of course so that's it from this video and i hope you have liked the explanation and learned from this video please do like and subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends and also don't forget to share the feedback in comment section i'll see you next video till then keep learning and thank you for watching